Right now, we're hearing from city officials in Charlotte about the three nights of protests. But they also made a statement about the fatal shooting of Keith Scott. Turn your side's Chris Horn live in the newsroom now with the details. Chris? Don, the press conference comes in the middle of demonstrations, destruction, and criticism for how Charlotte authorities are handling the shooting death of Scott. Many wonder why police have not released the video. Well, the chief just said in the past hour, the case has now been handed over to the North Carolina State Bureau of Investigation, so it will be their call. Mayor Jennifer Roberts says she believes the video should be released, and the question is a matter of timing. Police Chief Kerry Putney says he wants the case to develop further before the video comes out. He says video can inflame a situation without people knowing the whole story. But critics say the Charlotte Mecklenburg Police Department needs to be more transparent. Scott's family has seen the video. Protesters last night walked city streets in what police are calling a largely peaceful demonstration. Police say they did get word last night that violent agitators from South Carolina were getting involved and authorities closed an interstate temporarily. They also have made an arrest now in the shooting death of a civilian protester Wednesday night. Charlotte has a curfew in effect until further notice. It begins at midnight and runs until 6 a.m. That means bars and restaurants must close at midnight. We're following this story. We'll have the latest on Wavy News 10 beginning at 4. Live in the newsroom, Chris Horn, 10 on your side.